Hey guys, this is Sound by Games, and I hope this is the last time I do this because I've been screwing up the save file uh, multiple times now. Anyway, I just want to quickly go over the two main sites that I visit for my video game soundtracks. The first one is downloads.kinsider.com, and I go here whenever I want to find, after I play like a video game, I like the soundtrack on it. I come here to find the, all the soundtracks of that video game. So, for example, if you go to M, uh, type in Metal Gear Solid, they have all of the, I'm pretty sure all of the Metal Gear Solid soundtracks here. And you can just click on one. You can find them individually from that soundtrack uh, album or just download them all on the top over here. <coughs> now, I don't think they have the licensing for these. So they can sell them, obviously. So if you ever wanted to like take any of these soundtracks and use it in a video or something, don't ask. Do not ask the the people on Kinsider. You have to ask the actual composer of the the song themselves. <coughs> like especially for Metal Gear Solid, you will probably talk to Konami. But then I pro um I don't know why you would talk to Konami because they will probably say no. Or ask for ludicrous amounts of money. Anyway, the second site will be Reddit. Uh, more specifically, two subreddits. Um, game music, slash game music, and slash VG covers. Now, game music is a lot more popular. It has 44.6... thousand... 44.6 thousand listeners, or followers, or subscribers whatever reddit wants to call them and people just post uh remixes all these uh videos youtube people uh people's own videos they will share on reddit all these different things that they they find interesting they post on reddit other people find it interesting they comment on on, on it and then you know community that's how community is born this is a great place if you're bored, if you browse Reddit anyway, and you have a lot of subreddits that you visit, this could be another one you could add. <coughs> the other one, uh, VG covers, it's not really remixy. You, you can say it's a remix, but like a lot, most of them are just covers. I think this site is new. I've only, I've only found this today, but Obviously, you can see there's a lot less subscribers or followers on this one. I think I'm like the only one. No, I'm not. I'm not even subscribed. I'm not even logged in on Reddit. Uh, these people, all these people post their uh, covers onto here. And then you have other people who also do covers. And then they just generally say, oh, you're great. Sometimes they they give you insight how to fix things, what's wrong, blah, blah, blah. But I mainly go on these because they're a lot of them are retro, pretty retro. Or not even retro, just like old games. <coughs> and sometimes when I'm like bored, I'll go on here and then there'll be a game that I haven't really, that I haven't remembered in a long time because I played it like 10 years ago. Or even like Kirby Epic Yarn. That game is pretty old. Now, I'm not gonna play it here, but like, if I, I'll probably play it later, on my own free time. But I'll probably listen to this and be like, oh, it's, that's pretty cool. I wonder if they have it on uh, Kinsider, and I'll probably search it on Kinsider. It probably won't be this easy, actually. Well, what do you know? It is that easy. Epic yarn. Yeah. Anyway, you don't need to see me do that. Oh, I found it anyway. They have all the soundtracks here, listen to it, all that good stuff. So yeah, this is my first screencast for Soundbite Games. And let me know if you guys like this video or not. You know, and if you like what you see and you want to see more, subscribe. And I'll see you all next time.